Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. In this video, we're going to do another unboxing. So this is a parcel that I got from my recent purchase or not so recent purchase from AliExpress. So I think it's just in time, you know, because 11.11 uh, is coming soon and hopefully you should be able to get some discount if you are interested to buy this piece from AliExpress. I'm going to leave links to this watch uh, in the description box below. I am an AliExpress affiliate. So if you use the link to buy something, I might get some commission from AliExpress, but at no cost to you. So if you're really interested with this watch, please use the link and it's a way to support my channel so that I can, you know, sustain my hobby and do more videos so similar to something like this. Okay. Wow. This is something new here. So what I have with me is a watch from Balcony. So uh, it's kind of a new brand. I think several YouTubers have already got their hands on this and made some good reviews on them. So yeah, if you're interested, I, I, will, I do suggest look at uh, those other reviews as well. Um, this video today is not going to be a full review. It's just an unboxing. So I'm going to share with you what I have with me and what is inside the box and what do we get for, for the for the money all right so yeah let's uh open the box up okay so it is also kind of refreshing because uh this is not like your regular aliexpress box uh, you know the typical box where they come with like a hard plastic case with some snap lock this one i think it's kind of a decent travel pouch with i think it's quite good you know it's zip so yeah you can throw your watch inside there and treat it as a travel pouch which i think is much better than those plastic case okay um what's included then well there's a nice polishing cloth and yep you have the website uh www w.baltany.cn okay the thing is that i did not get this from baltany aliexpress shop or i think there's another one um, kraken something something i believe i got this from steel dive yeah <laughs> it's funny because um steel dive steel dive aliexpress shop i think they also sell this baltany and somehow I was able to get a better discount um, from that uh, discount code that they provided to me. So I purchased it from uh, this uh, Steel Dive. But uh, I'm going to leave links to several sellers. So maybe you can, you know, click the link, compare the price and add them onto your cart and get ready for 11.11 when there is going to be some big discount. So yeah, uh, let's try to peel off some stickers. I most of the time I do find this kind of you know wrapper kind of hard to peel off so yeah um, focus 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 yes so this is the watch I think it looks pretty nice um, they have I think several versions one is with the Beltany logo one is without the Beltany logo and you can also opt for a leather NATO strap but uh, because I see that the leather NATO could be kind of thick so I went with this normal NATO strap and I think it's pretty nice because the needle strap also comes with a brush hardware that is matching that uh, brush or bead blasted or sand blasted case or satin case, whatever you want to call it. Uh, from the look of it, I can proportionally feel that the watch is, I think, 38 millimeters, 36, 38. Um, yeah, I'm going to leave the numbers here. And But proportionally, um, it does feel kind of thick. I mean, this is my first impression, so uh, I will do like a proper measurement in the full review video. But uh, yeah, first impression, it's kind of thick. Um, and what do we have here? We have just a solid screw down case back. Nothing much on it. All right. So it's an automatic uh, movement. I believe it's from Seagull. So let's uh, see if we can wind it up. Yep, it's hand windable. Second click, um, let's see, okay, first click. So there's no date, so there's no date, go state position, so it's nice. And yeah, it has that really vintage look, vintage appeal. Um, so, and thing, yeah, it comes with a screw down crown, which is, yeah, kind of good. So if you're not familiar with this kind of watch design, I think they are based on what 
a lot of uh, watch fans are calling the so-called dirty dozen design it's based on i think 12 watches that were like you know issued to militaries during the second world war and yeah they are calling it the dirty dozen so this balcony model is also taking some inspiration from that dirty dozen uh, watch model so i believe there are also some bigger brands like i believe maybe hamilton or some other bigger brands that um, also do this kind of uh, vintage uh, reissue of those dirty dozen, dozen, dirty dozen watch but this one i think it comes in a very attractive price and the case size i think is staying quite true to the original uh, watches from back then so yeah let's quickly put it on my wrist and see how it looks um yeah so i will normally put my nato watches on my wrist in such a way because i have a small wrist and i do not like the feeling of having two layers of uh, fabric or nato straps in between the watch and my wrist so i will normally wear it in such a way okay let's try to do this all right Thing. we're almost there okay let me zoom out a little bit okay so yeah this is how the watch look on my six inch or 15.2 centimeters wrist i think the watch size sits quite nice on my wrist and it's not overly small because um the luck to luck i would say it's not too short even for a, a watch of this size i yeah see um, it's okay it's not overly small it's not overly big so i believe this watch will fit a lot of wrist sizes even if you have a bigger wrist you're concerned that maybe that small case diameter might not be up to your taste but i can tell you that the longer luck to luck distance does make up for the size of the watch which i think is quite good and i don't know why they also provided uh, us with this uh, spring bar tool but uh, since this is a nato strap watch um i don't think we'll be needing that unless you want to change it to you know a, a third party um, leather strap which i think will look quite good you know if you have a vintage distress leather strap um i believe it will look quite good as well so yeah this is my short unboxing video for this watch so if you're interested of my full uh, opinion in the full review video please help to subscribe to my channel and um, yeah all right, I'll catch you guys in the next video and stay safe. And yeah, just enjoy your happy purchasing moment for 11.11 on AliExpress. All right, bye-bye.